And we are back. As you may remember from last time, uh, I had found myself in quite a bit of a pickle. I had lost pretty much all my men, all my continues, and only three life points left. And if I got hit again, or rather lost that life again, it would have been all over. And this is one of those games that if you lose all your uh, you lose all your health and all your life and you know you have no continues you go all the way back to the beginning and you gotta start all over again this is one of the reasons by back when I was a kid I could only beat this once so what I did and it sure was a good thing that I uh, went back to the uh, what's it called I saved at the claw machine for whatever reason and it's a good thing I did because I went back to that uh, level, I beat it in one try. And then I passed uh, Sid's desk pretty, uh, pretty straightforward, and I was able to uh, complete it, no problem. And my control is not working. Hold on a second. Ah. Uh... Give me a minute. Okay, now I think it's working. Uh, I guess the uh, thing that lets me use my PS3 controller on uh, the computer has to be started up every single time. It's kind of annoying. Anyways, yes, now I can uh, try this again with... Well, I guess I'll... Little, well, even extremely little better luck, but still, even if I lose these lives, I still have several continues to work with. So, should only suck a little bit. But in the other case, I, I have to admit that was kind of ingenious of me to uh, remember about, uh, or at least. Be able to save the game over at uh, back at the claw as sort of an unintentional backup. Oh, and I was just about to comment about having mad uh, lasso skills. Shows how much I know, huh? There they are. There's the mad pull string skills. Man, it's got some uh, foreboding music going on here. Jump, 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 jump. Yeah. Uh. Still don't know. Still can't remember what exactly is after this, though. Uh. Can't be that far. Away. Can't be that far away from the uh, rest of the game because after Sid's house, you just gotta chase down the moving van. I know that there's at least one more RC level. That's probably the one that gives everyone a hard time. <laughs> so, because that desk one really wasn't that bad. It's actually kind of fun, I have to say. Did I see those uh, those spike balls just hanging from nothing? It's Spider-Man syndrome. He always manages, back in like old media, to like sling his webs into the air and get up and like you know just go, go about his business. There wasn't even there was even a an old commercial for the old Spider-Man cartoon. Oh, ah, you would eat your toy. Use your karate chop action. Ah, <laughs> nice. Damn it. Watch out. Watch out. Uh, this is not good. Oh, now I gotta do that all the fuck over again. Fucking figures. <clears throat> what is the speed up thing on this? Huh? 
I don't know if you can hit the baby spider head thing, whatever the hell it is, so. And after that little excursion, I don't want to find out. But at least I have five more lives to play with this time around. Anyways, getting back to what I was saying earlier, there was a commercial for the old uh, Spider-Man cartoon on Fox, which uh, made fun of the fact that Spider-Man hung on to nothing. Uh, just shot his web up into the air, and just <laughs> slung it into it. And they actually fixed this in, like, uh, the later Spider-Man games. Like, I think it was <clears throat> Spider-Man 2 that started doing it. You, ca you had to actually latch onto the buildings, which, you know, made a heck of a lot more sense since... He's kind of swinging around in the urban jungle there. Alright, I think now we're making uh, a bit more progress. Those things are horrifying. They're not even mutant toys, they're just spiders and whatnot that were made by Kinex or something. And totally not whatever it is that new Xbox 360 peripheral is. You know, the one that everyone makes fun of for being uh, the Wii. <clears throat> I think the PS3 is getting one too. It's, I think, the, the move or something. Yeah, there we go. I should really look to see if there's a checkpoint down here. Yes, there is. I just gotta work my way back up. Oh, no. I've sucked enough for one lifetime, thank you. Come here. I can just hold it down. There you go. It's a little uh, less taxing. Damn it! Ah, oh, what the hell? Is it not being uh, attacked? Ridiculous. See, this is why I called it lame play theater. And I just really screwed myself over there. I just have to be a little more, uh, a little more careful, but then again, baby head back there is, uh, getting a little dangerously close whenever I do that. You know what? Screw it, I'm making a save state. Uh, give me a minute. Okay, uh, I think that takes care of that. Because I'm not gonna go through the entire level again, even for how short it is, to put up with this crap ever again. All right, lane play can only go so far. And I know you can turn around and hit baby head, or at least try to, but, you know, you got two of these guys in front of you, a baby head back there, so, uh, doesn't really do much justice. I don't want to really, really risk uh, trying to fend him off when I can't even fend these two off. See, look at that, it doesn't work. There you go. Uh, 
Ah, this is getting ridiculous. Doing good so far, but any minute now. There we go. That's more like it. And I can finish the level and finish the video too. Sweet. Even with all my sucking, I still managed to pull it off.